it's gonna get. Gonna get cold, and as I promised you, uh, we're gonna see an explosion of colors in the sky. And we did saw you, it. Did yeah. you catch it too? Yeah, yeah. I caught Probably it on glimpse. time lapse for you. Uh, the last five minutes, especially, you know, it was just cloudy up until the right moment. Cloud breaks started to happen. I'm gonna pause this at five. I think it was 35, and some of those colors just uh, not even doing it justice on the TV. But a lot of us running to the windows out there to see just how amazing it was. All right, John said, how cold is it gonna get? Well, it was 46 this morning. It would have been colder than that if those east winds died down. A a little bit average low 47 so batting still just uh, a little bit below average here 27 that was cold in Sierra Vista high temps today though 66 courtesy of the clouds that kept temperatures about nine degrees below average for this time of year I'm calling this a tale of two Novembers through the first 13 days of this month our average temperature 61.9 degrees last year through the first 13 days 70.3 degrees so much much cooler this November and October was much much cooler can you imagine this month now if we go below average that'll be back to back consecutive months with below average temperatures something we haven't done in many years don't have the exact figure of how many years it's been I know September 2016 was the first time we didn't have we had a month below average until last month Back to back, we'll have to check on that. All right, here's your current wind gusts, and boy, they are starting to die down quite substantially. 60, still partly cloudy at the airport, and east winds happy to report just 7 miles per hour. Very dry air mass, 16. So if we lose the clouds, we can keep those winds down. You know what? We could be in for a pretty cool night of weather. Warm spots right around 60, cooler spots right around the upper 50s. So not much variety across Metro Tucson, but lots of 40s and Bisbee, Sierra Vista, Wilcox, and Sonoida. And we'll see 40s here, too, in Tucson. Uh, right around the midnight hour, so maybe mid 40s by about 2 a.m. So it could be one of those nights where we bottom out right around 40 degrees, several degrees below average. Courtesy of clouds starting to decrease the state from west to east at a pretty rapid fashion. Very cold area of low pressure bringing snow to Arkansas today. Western sections of Kentucky, Tennessee, northern sections of Mississippi seeing snow. High pressure ruling our roost. Here's your forecast on for tonight upper 30s to low 40s sunny skies tomorrow less wind east southeast winds 5 to 15 could see a couple of breezes but not nearly as windy as we've seen in the last couple of days 60s for Bisbee Tombstone Wilcox after nighttime lows in the 20s and 30s feeling a little winter like 72 tomorrow 72 Friday room temperature I like that nighttime lows the whole while being in the low 40s and once again let's kind of pinpoint Saturday I'll tour to Tucson cool start bikers are going to like that no wind and a a lot of sunshine, daytime high right around 70 degrees. Right. Room temperatures, that's what I have my thermostat set. Perfect. <laughs> yes. Don't they do anything? No. Nope. Just keep perfect. it as such. All right, let's check in with Paul.